everyone, what's going on? You might remember a while ago, I went to the Levi store in LA and got this trucker jacket customized by Levi's Tailors. This is my official NRG Levi's Legacy trucker jacket, and it tracks all the accomplishments throughout my career. I just wanted to show you guys a few of the best moments of my career. So let's jump into the video. All right, time to uh, react to some clips. I actually like really hate looking at old clips. I don't know why. I hate watching clips of myself, but we're gonna dive into uh, some good old ones today. All right. Like the beginning, beginning, beginning of Apex. Oh my god. I mean, it's not bad. I miss Skull Town. I would definitely uh, go back to these days. Um, yeah, this is definitely when I was kind of falling in love with Apex. Never really played a game like it before. I never thought I was really good like uh, I was getting. Even that clip though uh, was a little, <laughs> a little body. Yeah, that was the beginning. The beginning of everything, really. I always know where I was according to my background. That I was back in Houston at that point. That was like also when I first started going uh, like full time. Nine, 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 nine. It's all nines. It's still all nines for me. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> that's like the I keep paying attention to my game though, but that's like the biggest my reactions oh. get. I, I really don't have I don't have, I don't really react. I don't know. I don't have big reactions, but um that was really exciting because I I just know that there's not a whole lot of people that have hit that one mil. Never did I think Actually, that's true. That's so true. Nutty. I miss this old world's edge. Oh my gosh. That feels like such a long time ago. Oh my goodness. That was an awesome milestone to hit. Now I just have to hit two mil. <laughs> now I have to hit the next milestone, which is way further away. But that was an awesome moment. That was really, that was really cool. Happening. This is happening. My tournament is happening. So excited though. It's gonna be fun. I've been playing in a tournament in literally ages. And I'm hoping this one goes really well. And then I can do more things like this in the future. <laughs> I guess I was about to host the first Lulu throwdown, which that was a lot of fun. It was awesome to put something like that together for the community. Would love to do another one, but it's probably not gonna happen. <laughs> um, but that was great. That was that was a really fun time. And I got really good feedback on everyone really enjoyed playing in that. So that makes me happy. But yeah, I guess that was like really big accomplishment. Also, not a lot of people get to host a uh, 100K tourney. So that was cool. That was pretty cool. Hold your shield, hold your shield. Uh, oh, let me, let me up the quality there. Um, this was the game. Solo solo queuing from Bronze and Masters was so like important to me. Um, I think this is it. I think this is it. I think it's because like I I really just wanted to prove to everyone that I could solo the Masters. It gets really tiring to just hear people discredit you and then like all the hard work I put in and constantly being told I get carried and everything. So that was that was like a huge deal to me. I was taking it very seriously and I will never do it again because <laughs> solo queuing from Bronze and Masters is not good for your mental, especially on Apex. I set that out for myself. It took me a couple of tries because I didn't really leave enough time in the previous seasons to do it. I, I'm still really proud of that, even though I still get called carried, but that's, <laughs> that's whatever. At least I did it. I can say I did it. It's done. It's in the books. It's a lot of fun. I really, I'm really happy with how we all play. Is this? Samsung tourney, I think. That's awesome. This is the best I ever did, really. I'm so happy. This is like the best I've ever done. Yeah. <laughs> before. It was. I, I was really proud of of how I played and and how far I've come. And that was that was kind of recent. That was like two months ago. But I, I was really proud of that. I was really proud of that second place. I finally was not super super nervous playing an attorney. I mean, I'm just, I was still really nervous, but I was playing a lot more confident, and that, that felt good. It felt good to beat some of the other teams there. Some teams that are like way better, but it felt good. So that, that was a good second.
right? Yeah. This is a super old clip. No, along the outside, right here, Watson. Down low. Let's go. Finally. Nothing bad. Not enough. Want to show it? It's just. I don't even know what season this was. <laughs> oh, barely. This. Oh, this is when I think there was no masters. It was just. It was like just Fred. So you just had to cross the threshold. That's it. Yeah, that was that was crazy. I don't really honestly remember much of like uh, playing at that time. I'm not gonna lie. Like it all kind of blends together at this point. But that was that was a long time ago. Oh my gosh. I was yeah, that was back in Houston as well. That just seems like a different lifetime. Oh my goodness. Oh geez, a Fortnite clip. I was terrible at Fortnite. I was not very good. I was not good. This was like when my stream somewhat started to grow too. I, I like started to be able to aim more because I hadn't been on PC a whole whole long like a long time because I played on console for forever and Fortnite was like the second shooter I ever played on PC. I couldn't build. I, I was terrible at building but I could kind of sort of aim so there was that but oh my gosh like I look so young. <laughs> it just this seems like a, a whole different lifetime. Oh my goodness. This was so long ago also. I love the creeper. Oh my gosh, the buns, the double buns in the hair. I've always liked sniping in like every every game I've really played, I've always enjoyed sniping. So of course I'm gonna love the creeper. <laughs> it's kind of got good with it, but yeah, I mean, I still I still love the creeper. I still try to hit some crazy shots. Sometimes I, I miss, I don't hit all my shots, but um, yeah, that was, that was also a long time ago. It just, it feels like a different lifetime watching these clips. Honestly. <laughs> Cover me. Oh, this is like when the train yeah, first came out. Yo, I'm jumping out here. <gasps> <laughs> Wait. Wait, you gotta get it, you gotta get it, you gotta get it, you gotta get it. Oh no, no, it pushed me off. <laughs> oh, you're so lucky. Good old Apex, yeah, all the, all the bugs and the dumb stuff you die from in Apex. Definitely a love-hate relationship there. That was that was actually kind of funny though, getting killed by the train like that. I think they fixed it after that. Um, I think I posted that on Twitter and they made a fix for that. But now the train's not even in the game anymore, so. <laughs> yeah, no, I definitely still have a love-hate relationship with Apex. It still has the potential to be one of the greatest BRs. It is tough to play with through all the bugs and problems, but I, I still I still love it. I still love it. <laughs>